Welcome to the Film Roast, where your favorite movies get torn a new one, with special host and guest Josh Cardenas and Olivia Anderson. Shit's gonna be wild. Hey there, welcome to Movie Talk. I'm here with my guest Olivia. We're gonna talk about some movies. Shit's gonna be whack. Shit's gonna be real whack. All right. So what do you want to talk about today? All right, today I'm t here to tell you guys how good of a movie Baby Driver is. And uh, <laughs> I'm going to start off by saying that, unlike what my compatriot here thinks, mm. uh, I think that the uh, action scenes are actually very well, and I think that they w l they're very good, and I think that they work very well with the music around it, and the way that it's timed out, it makes it look amazing. The characters are awesome, every single one of them. Kevin Spacey, like, out of this... Outstanding performance. I'll agree with that part. And that girl, I think her name is Darling, is super attractive. You know, just gives you something really nice to look at the whole time. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> But uh, I'd like to hear what you uh, have to say about it. So, <laughs> baby driver. Um, the opening. I actually wouldn't like to hear what you say, but you know, we'll do you it. You know, anyway. we'll just, we have to. Um, the opening sequence, I will admit, was very well done. Um, that scene was spectacular, and it kind of. Um, it got me thinking, okay, well, maybe the rest of the movie is going to be just like this, and I'm really looking forward to it. I was wrong. So the whole movie, in my opinion, um, had very repetitive pacing, three parts with the same beginning, middle, and end. Uh, I didn't like Ansel Eggert. Was that his name? I really didn't like him. Okay. I thought they should have casted someone else. I was thinking they should have casted Joseph Gordon-Levitt or yeah. like a different younger actor because I, I just didn't like him. Uh, also, the whole creativity... I loved what they were trying to do. Mm -hmm. Like it could have been, you know, very. It could have been. It could have been a little better because I've I've seen movies where they've matched the percussion of music with, like the sequences. But with, with Baby Driver, that's all they were focused on. I feel like there wasn't any creativity in the actual scene. Like I've seen a warehouse shootout at least a dozen times. Like it, there was nothing really interesting about the scene. But we'll get more into that when we come back from commercial, and shit's gonna be even wackier. <laughs> Hi there folks, I'm here to tell you about the new product, Professor Bob's Miracle Elixir. Have a school project or essay coming up and just can't think of any ideas? One sip and you'll be done with your project in no time. Not only does it give you geniuses ideas, but it tastes great too. Ah, delicious. Pick up your very own can of Professor Bob's Idea Elixir at all locations where they sell drinks. Only one dollar and nine nine cents. And we're back. We're going to talk more about Baby Driver. To counteract what you said about all the action sequences just being the same thing three times, I disagree. I think that the first one was like uh, it was definitely like the best one out of the whole movie. Like I will admit, like it kind of built it up mm -hmm. a little bit and mm -hmm. then kind of like plateaued for us thing. But it plateaued like way up here. You know, like it was good the whole time. So, but like I thought that they all had different very like. The second one, like some stuff went wrong, like there was that guy coming after him, and then the mm. third one, like everything went wrong, and they're running through the entire city, and he's trying to like get away from the cops. Darling dies, like all that stuff, like that, and then that stuff at the end with the parking garage, that was insane. Like it just was like super high tense the whole time. Like even if it was a little repetitive, like I thought that the symbolism with like the circular thing and going around and doing the same thing, like I just thought there was so much like symbolism with just like circular and like round imagery going on. Like I thought that was really. I thought you know, that they. Um, the thing is, is that they. Use too much symbolism. I thought that the symbolism of repeating was good enough in the beginning when he was going to the coffee shop and then back, and then mm -hmm. repeating that same, like the same walk, like getting the four coffees and like going back and forth. It's like the same thing every time he has the heist. I heard, but I thought that the dialogue was very weak. I thought it was extremely weak. It could have been a little bit better. And I love Edgar Wright. Don't get me wrong. I think he's an amazing director, but it definitely could have been. A little bit better. Well, well, we'll just have to agree to disagree. That's all we have for today. Great talk. Good night, America. God bless. <laughs>